yeah, I'm going to be playing Final Fantasy VI for the first time in my entire life. I absolutely have no idea about this game. Um, even if it has like this legendary status in the JRPG community. So yeah, I'm extremely, extremely happy to be playing it for the first time finally. And I'm really happy to be here with you guys as well as we start. You guys will, I'll take you for this first journey. Uh, my first playthrough, the blind playthrough. I am just aware of some of uh, like two characters and uh, that's it. So it's going to be uh, it's going to be a total total first first playthrough. Uh, I got a code from Square Enix, so big uh, big big thanks to Square Enix for giving me the code for the game so I can play it for you guys and um, well take you on this first journey. <gasps> ah, music. Nobody told me it's gonna be a horror game. <laughs> the ancient word of the Magi. When its flames at last uh, receded, only the charred husk of a world remained. Even the power of magic was lost. Oh, it's like fully 16 to 9, that's awesome. The thousand years that followed, iron, gunpowder, and steam engines took the place of magic and life slowly returned to the barren land. Oh, I'm, I'm familiar with this theme. Yet, there now stands one who would reawaken the magic of ages past and use its dread power as a means by which to conquer the world. Was that the, the palazzo? That might have been him. Could anyone truly be foolish enough to repeat that mistake? There's always some foe. Okay, the the pixels are looking cute on the twenty uh, on the twenty seven inches uh, monitor. They look kind of. Ooh, it's her. Wedge. <laughs> oh no. Hard to believe an Esper has been found frozen there a thousand years after the War of the Magi. Bah, probably just another wild goose chase. Wait, I can't control the... I don't know. I can't control the dialogues. Oh, no. They wouldn't have let us uh, use her unless they were confident the intel was good. Oh, that creates a series of... Uh, difficulties for me. The witch... Relax, with that thing on her head, she's a mindless puppet. The girl won't even breathe unless we tell her to. Hopefully we can change it later. We'll approach from the east. Move out. Wedge is a baddie? Wedge is a baddie? No. Oh, we're gonna cry. Yeah, the SFX uh, sound. The MIDI. Oh. Yes, bring it in. Oh, <laughs> didn't, okay, didn't didn't expect to hear it so so early. I've seen this before. <laughs> That's a Theres theme. The, I think the main theme of this game. We know this one. Loving, loving the pixel look so far. I just am a little bit concerned that I cannot control the um, tempo of the dialogue that they are on autoplay. That's a little bit of a concern of mine right now. Where are we going? Okay, so they put something on Terra's head to stop her magic. 
Normally a few credits are blended in here. I guess they changed it. Oh, the credits should be in uh, in here? Yeah, it fits like a... It, it does look like the credits could fit in here. Ooh, all right. The town is showing. I guess they will put the credits at the end of the game now. Yeah, six is a favorite of many people, and I'm finally about to find out why my uh, why that might be. Girl takes point, and don't waste time on the riffraff. Remember what we're here for. Let's move. Oh, okay. I feel like I finally maybe on just some cutscenes the dialogue will be on autoplay. Alright, so we're going to Narsh. Imperial Magic Armor? Not even Narsh is safe anymore. Woo! <laughs> oh my gosh, why this makes me so excited? <laughs> alright, alright. Let's go with the Thunderbeam, maybe. And. Oh, we are controlling Biggs and Wedge as well. Man, we're OP! Magic. Fire. Such a banger. This makes me so excited. <laughs> the old school Final Fantasy. <laughs> so much. According to our source, some miners unearthed the frozen Esper in a new shaft they were digging. This must be it. I wonder if this was the first game where summons were called Espers. Wow. I was like, I don't know anything about this game, but like the all, every music just sounds so familiar, like I've definitely heard it before. But I'm Final Fantasy fan for goodness. Almost 20 years now. Oh my gosh, you can just hear Uematsu's like that times Uematsu. It is incredible. I'll handle this. Stand back. They're they're mind controlling her though. We're we're not doing this on our own accord. We are not handing over the Esper. Ymir, get them. Oh subjects of Ymir. Oh my gosh, Ymir! That's the enemy from Final Fantasy! From Final Fantasy XIV! <laughs> I mean... Okay, if you guys don't know, this is actually one of the bosses in Sestasha Hard. And I did not know about that. This is my first time seeing the original. Hold it! This thing's a... They must have trained it to guard the mines. What are you talking about? You know what it, uh, what this is? Ever heard of a lightning whelk? It's a monster that absorbs lightning. <laughs> this is so good. And stores the energy in its shell. Right. So whatever you do, don't attack the shell. Ah, thank you so much for the tutorial, Biggs. Oh, don't attack its shell. Don't attack the shell. What is that freaking guitar? How good this is. I am a woman who was too stunned to speak. How good is this version? <laughs> Ymir. Oh, I, I want to do Shinjengeki no Kyojin cosplay so much. Half of my brain registered this as Final Fantasy VI OST and the other half a Sigma Escape. Uh oh. Okay, don't attack the shell. Don't attack the shell. Let's defend this time. Honestly? 
I feel like this ionization is much... It's more hype than Sigma Scape version. It has that old school, but the, the new, like, feel to it. It's crazy good. Especially the guitar. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. I'm thinking about it, girl. Just, just thinking about it. Maybe I'm gonna do it. <laughs> Such insane battle music for a snail. It's a, it's a, <laughs> it's a boss battle though. <laughs> it's Ymir. Is the subject of Ymir? Highly trained snail. <laughs> To, you know, protect the Esper. The Ice Esper. Ice Esper could be Shiva. Uh, actually, right? No, no, the big said to not attack the shell. Right? I, I got it correctly, right? He is much... Uh, much stronger than all the other bosses for sure. Got him! Militarized French cuisine. <laughs> oh? So, this is the frozen Esper? We have to fight it. This thing's giving me the creeps. Shiva looks different. Something's not right. It's funny, like, all the summons in Final Fantasy, like, history, the summons were, like, given or, like, obtained, but espers are the one that you have to fight to, like, gain them. Yeah, I don't know what it looks like, but let's see. The frozen creature begins emanate, uh, emitting, emitting, emitting an eerie light. Where's that light coming from? Where? I'm... I'm a prof... Whoa! I'm a professional uh, voice actor. No, no, no. I am not a professional voice actor, so... Please don't comment on my dubbings. But... I will try my best. What was that? Wedge? It was nice knowing you, Wedge, I suppose. Where are you? Hey, what's going on? Say hello to... to Wedge. Okay. Some cutscenes, they were supposed to be 2D, uh, like 2D HD. Alright. We're back in Narsh. Back to the smooth blues. Don't worry, their home point is set to Gold Saucer. I'm jealous. Where am I? My, my. And I only just removed the crown. My head hurts. Oh. Easy there. This is a slave crown. The others were using it to control you. It was robbing you of your thoughts, making so you'd, uh, you would do whatever they told you. I can't remember a thing. Don't worry, it will all come back to you. In time, that is. Mysterious young woman, born with the gift of magic, and enslaved by the Gestalchlian. <laughs> Is it like Gestalt? Near Gestalt? Gestalian? I'm just gonna say it Ges Gestalian? Gestalian Empire? Ooh. Yeah, this song... 
it tu it touches it touches heart for sure uh yeah we're going to keep the original name that's how i usually do it uh with final fantasy games except for final fantasy 9 um <laughs> when Quina was named Bob. My name is Terra. Impressive. I've never heard of anyone recovering so fast. You must be made of tougher stuff than most. A little piano. Oh. So Empire enslaved me. Or, or Tinas. Ter Terras. Open up. We're here for the magic armor pilot. Open this door right now. Hand over that girl. She's an agent of the Empire. Agent? It's been a while since I've like read this story, so if I'm... Ooh, if I'm gonna like horribly... <laughs> um, read something horrible, uh, horribly, please, please don't hold it against me, okay? Empire? Magic armor? There's no time to explain. You need to get out of here. These fools aren't going to listen uh, Listen to reason. Listen. This way, quickly. This is gonna be a Slavic uh, playthrough, okay? This way, uh, quickly, my friend. Let's go. Fortunately, all of those NPCs have like a um, secret passage in their homes. Good souls. Make your way out of the town through the mines. I will try to buy you some time. Oh man. Are you guys ready to deal one damage without the armor? This guy just wanted to steal my armor. That's what it was. Uh, up there. Uh oh. Not... Sh what? Oh, okay, I'm like on top so they can't see me. I was like, wow, that's gonna be the end of the game if they if they catch me here. Oh no. Do I even have a flipping like anything to attack with? Okay, she's a magical person, right? So let's just do it with the with the magic. Is there a people trumpet? Holy shit, we need a people trumpet. Please give links with the quickness. Okay, let's see her attack. Okay, 31. Not too bad. How much how much fire and a shield? Awesome. You go, Terra. We did it! There she is! Oh shit! Oh, okay, that's convenient. Oh, game over. <laughs> she, she just <laughs> splashed on her face. Oh, poor thing, she's so sad! Oh. My sweet little magic user. <laughs> oh, Kafka is gonna be so much fun to voice. Bring it on, bring it on. <clears throat> it's Kek Kekka. With this slave crown, you'll be all mine. Well, he laughs for a long time. Okay, so this is like a... What happened in the past? <laughs> good, good! Oh, he's using the magic deck as well? Burn them all to a crisp!
Man, the music. Soldiers of the Empire, we stand at the dawn of a new age. The lost power of magic has returned to us. We have been chosen. The time has come for us to claim our rightful dominion over the world. Nothing shall stand in our way. Hurrah! Long live Emperor Gestal. This is fine. Not really a fan of these new boxes. Yeah, they're super smooth, aren't they? I mean, I think the choice of the 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 uh, the chosen the the choice the choice of the font is kind of weird. Like it's uh kind of doesn't doesn't match the pixel. Oh oh, this is one of the party members. I've seen his pixel model around. I've never seen their like actual art besides Terra's though. I think. Terra is the most famous and Kefka and yeah, I just don't know about anyone else. I think I met a few of them in the world of Final Fantasy, but... <sighs> Took you long enough, busy with all the robbing and plundering, I presume. Is this Tancred? Hello, this is Tancred. <laughs> what is this thing? <laughs> a treasure hunter and trail-worn traveler searching the world over for relics of the past. This is Tancred. The OG Tancred. His name is the Lock. Can I call him Tancred? <laughs> Are you guys gonna be mad at me? I prefer the term treasure hunting. Ha! Huh, semantic nonsense. That's a huge difference. Anyway, is there something you need me to do? There is a need. I met a girl. <laughs> it's an old man, okay. I met the girl. Girl? You don't mean. The city guard is pursuing her as we speak. The city has the strength to stand up to the Empire, but it won't use it. The people are just too stubbornly independent to join an underground resistance group like the Returners. I tried to explain that the Empire was controlling the girl, but they wouldn't even listen. Even Evan. What the heck? Alright, so you want me to get her out of Narsh? That would be an idea. Make your way to Figaro for the time being. I know Figaro! That's the third thing I know from this game. I know Figaro. That was the desert place, or like castle in the desert or something. I've seen it in other games. Seven is the older one, uh, is the only one I have ever played, so even... I'm so hyped for this. <laughs> Sorry, Chrisu. <laughs> oh, I think he got too late, Lok. Lotske. Seven is the oldest one I have played, or even seen, so I'm hyped for this. Ah, there it is. I can't... I can't, uh, read either, so, so don't worry. There she is. Wonderful. There's a whole bunch of them. You guys like the Kupo? You guys like the narration so far, by the way? Am I doing a good job? Muggles! Are you saying you want to help? The lovely days where Muggles couldn't speak. They just said Kupo. Those were the days. Oh, god damn it, Steve. <laughs> oh, is that a boss fight? Dance? Oh, I want the Moogle dance. Holy shit, they're quick. Man, I'm kind of glad that we played the Sigma Scape yesterday on stream in Final Fantasy XIV because we heard this music and we have like the comparison of the two. Any particular reason why this is a favorite for so many? Uh, is the story so strong? I th it's probably gonna be hard to say without spoilers, but um, I, I think 
Final Fantasies are mostly liked or like picked as a favorite because of the stories, because of the characters, um, because of the events in the game and what happens between the characters. There's probably nostalgia as well. Uh, I can imagine Final Fantasy VI was a first Final Fantasy to many uh, players, and I've seen um, this kind of. Um, I've seen it with many people that people tend to say the first Final Fantasy they played is their favorite. It definitely applies to me. Like Final Fantasy X was my introduction to the series and um, it's definitely my favorite, 100%. But yeah, I think it's the story and the characters mostly. I know absolutely nothing about Final Fantasy VI, um, so I can't say. <laughs> why it has a such a legendary status but i'm very excited to find out final fantasy 4 was my first and favorite mm -hmm. i think yeah i think the villain is also considered one of the best in the entire series and i think the strong villain can also be a reason why people uh really like um final fantasy music mm -hmm, music When it comes to my favorite Final Fantasies, um, it's definitely nostalgia and um, the attachment to the characters I have. Okay, enough of these moogles. Thank you so much. We're in your depth. Depth, 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 depth. Undeserved hate. Uh, I mean, hate? No, of course not, but mm, like criticism? I think I think it deserved deserved criticism. <laughs> the switch is out of I think Final Fantasy VI is also loved by so many because it, they really put Final Fantasy series on like a different track like 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 those are like just so freaking good I mean I haven't played 6 so I don't know but like 7, 8, 9, 10 they're like mind-blowing games to me personally huh? you big um, back with us now? the OG Tancred I wonder if Locke was like a uh, inspiration for Tancred you saved me Save your things for the Moogles. Can't remember a thing, it's like my mind's trapped in a fog. You lost your memory? A man said it would come back eventually. Ah, so you've got an amnesia. Don't worry, I won't leave your side until your memory returns. <laughs> Go luck! I'm not gonna up and abandon someone just because they they lost their memory. I'll keep you safe, I promise. I, li I like it, I like how positive and like helpful he is. The light mood is, is strong with this one. <gasps> chocobos! Oh, we, first, we went first chocobos of the game. Halt! Oh, it's you. Proceed. They know me? Go and speak to the king. Is the king that handsome blonde dude? I know him from... From Final Fantasy. World of Final Fantasy. Edwards... The OG Tancred? You mean this young woman is... Oh, we love the long-haired husbandos. Who are you? Oh, my apologies. How rude of me to turn my back to a lady on our very first meeting. The young king of Figura Castle, imperial ally and champion of the technological revolution. Ed- oh, Edgar. I was like, was his name Edward? Edward or something? Edgar, that's that's the name. 
Edgar. I am Edgar, the King of Figaro. Huh, surprised that someone like me knows a king. Uh, yeah, kinda am. Uh, I'll catch you two later. No, look, come back! I wanted you to be my friend. So, you're an Imperial soldier, right? Don't worry, Figaro and the Empire are allies. But Empire... So that is actually not a good thing, right? Because Empire was like... Why... Why he brought me here? If Locke is from that other city and the city was invaded by the Empire... A little bit confused. Are we are we bodies? Are we bodies in this game? Feel free to rest here for as long as you'd like. It's not in my blood to harm a lady. Are you why are you being so kind to me? It is because of my abilities. I'll give you three reasons. First of all, your beauty has captivated me. Oh, he's one of those. Second, I'm dying to know if I'm your type. <laughs> I guess your abilities would rank a distant third. He needs to get bonked. Hold down your chocobos. You don't like them flushy guys? <laughs> uh, yeah, it stopped being funny a long time ago. <laughs> What's the matter? I guess it's okay if you're a Final Fantasy character, because you're probably hot. Wait, I should I Google his art? I guess my technique's getting a bit rusty. Hmm, I suppose some girls would have felt something from those words, but not me. Tara's not your pick me girl. Oh, there is a high priestess. The music stop. Uh oh. Edgar has a twin brother. You know, he was such a nice boy, always thinking of his family. What's Edgar's last name? I think we are in for a plot. This guy really, this guy also looks like a party member. Edgar, what's wrong with dad? Why is everyone talking about a successor? Are you blind? Haven't you seen how thin his face has become? Oh no, it's Sag game now. What do you mean? Edgar! Are you crying? Edgar's twin brother, who traded the throne for his own freedom. Sabin. Never heard about this character. Alright. Ah yes, Sabin. I'm sure he's a fine young man by now. He was just a boy when he left. Even smaller than his brother. I often wonder where he is now and what is he's doing. Back to the trumpets. Well, wait, I need to channel my playboy voice. How do you like my castle? King Edgar, there's someone from the Empire here to see you, sire. Hefka? No doubt. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, Kefka! He's not having like a silly makeup or anything. He actually... I was like thinking, why would Empire trust someone in the, with a the clown makeup or whatever? Pewie. Emperor Gestalt, stupid orders. Edgar, you pinhead. Why do you have to live out in the middle of this stinking desert? These raccoon jobs are the pits. Ahem. There is sand on my boots. All gone, sire. <laughs> Pathetic. 
pathetic idiots. Gives me the vibes of uh, Scarlet from Seven. I love it. Sir Kefka, what in the world brings you out of my way? I love voicing the villains, they're the best. Uh, okay. I hear you've been busy down south, taking over a country or three. Just what is the Empire up to? That's none of your concern. You wouldn't be thinking of invading my kingdom next, would you? Oh, no. Uh, we have an alliance? An alliance? With this miserable uh, little sandpit? Don't make me laugh. What brings Emperor Gestal, own court mage, Kafka, to my humble castle? A girl of no importance recently escaped from us. We heard that she found refuge here. This wouldn't have to do with that witch everyone been whispering about, would it? Lies! She merely stole something of minor value. Is she here? That's a tough one. There are more girls in here than grains of sand in the desert. A man couldn't possibly keep track of them all. Oh, Edgar. You know you only stand to lose by trying to hide her from us. <laughs> I truly hope nothing happens to your precious Figaro. Yeah, I'm not nervous at all. That was a very comfortable conversation. I didn't, I didn't like the sound of that. Where's Terra? Take her to her room. I'd love to stay and chat, but the counselor and I have some planning to do. Being a king is not all tea and crumpets. Now, if you'll excuse me, trumpets. Did they say trumpets? Follow me. Okay, Pancrit. I mean, lock. Ah, wait, 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 wait. I'm not so fast. Tea and trumpets? Sorry, I didn't mean to drag you around like this without giving you a chance to rest. Um, lock, right? Edgar told me about you. Is it true you're a thief? I'm a treasure hunter. On the surface, Edgar pretends to support the Empire. Truth is, he's collaborating with an underground resistance group called the Returners. I serve them as their go-between. The old man you met in Narsh is one of us too. <gasps> we're not the buddies! We're not the buddies, we're the part of the resistance. Hells yeah! The Empire, but I'm an Imperial soldier. Not anymore. They were using you, that's all. Things are different now. Now we are going to use you and brainwash you. What a great idea. It's just... I don't know what I should do. What I, uh, whenever I try to think, it just makes my head hurt even worse. I'm gonna trust them, because the other guys have ominous music playing in the background when they appear, so... I feel like they are not the buddies. <laughs> All that matters is that you make your own decisions from now on. Oh, so I don't have to stay with you. <laughs> Try not to think too hard right now. You'll know what you want to do when the time comes. When the music stops. How will I know what choice is right? That's a good question. Oh no, I've been sleeping in his room! Whoops. Trust the music. What in the... Men going with the quickness. Uh, what's going on? Is the Empire, Kefka, he... What do you think you're doing? I think the game is like allowing me to do the quick save. <laughs> Oh, he's a machinist! Okay. Oh, you can put him in like a back row. Awesome. Bring me the girl. 
now. I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, then enjoy the barbecue. <laughs> Um, uh, okay, let's go and find her, maybe. It's fine. Uh, this is fine. This is fine. Oh my gosh, let me through! I'm a king! Fucking hell! The castle's on fire! You don't fucking say! <laughs> okay. Fire! Fire! Hey! <laughs> Okay, well, I gotta find her, but everything... Get her ready. Yes, sire. Had a change of heart. It seems I have no choice. Oh, chocobos for the win. There will always help. Or better, helps I do. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave all my subjects to burn in here. Oh my, the brave and noble king abandons his people to save his own skin. How utterly delightful. <laughs> Jump! Oh, but why he's running away? What about his ten wives? Alright, sink her into the sand. Yahoo! What is this dialogue? Oh, of course! It's a moving castle! I totally forgot. Figaro dive mode! Engaged! Witness the, gl witness the glory of Figaro! It's a moving sand castle. They have the technology. <laughs> Thank you for joining us. Go kill them! <laughs> oh man, chocobos run! Oh, I thought chocobos are gonna be quicker! Let's go, Edgar! I've heard so many good things so far on this remaster. The, um, the experience is amazing so far. 10 out of 10. Was the matter, Edgar? <laughs> What happened? <laughs> what made you jump like that all of a sudden? Did, 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 you, did you just see what I saw? You did it, right? Right? Yeah, this kid's really something. Oh, I actually missed it. What did I do? Really? Something? That was magic! Magic! B -b 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 magic She used magic? Whisper, 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 whisper. Whisper, whisper, whisper. Terra. Your name was Terra, right? What? What exactly? What was that just now? I'm sorry, I. <laughs> no, we're the ones who should be apologizing. I didn't mean to make such a big deal out of it. No, nor did I. It just surprised me. I mean, I've never actually seen magic before. Why did you? It doesn't matter, does it, Edgar? Terra can use magic, and we can't. That's all there is to it. The fact is, her magic could really help us right now. Thank you, Locke. No, we have auto crossbow, though. Very fitting reaction, yeah, for the world with no magic. Soon. <laughs> they are here for her abilities now. That's the first reason. So he would just brought two soldiers with him. Son of a sandworm, you'll pay for this. Was great. Were those bad people? I'm scared. 
I'm waiting for the chocobo theme to just like blast, but I don't know if it's gonna happen. Terra, there's someone we would like you to meet. Like I told you before, we are members of the Returners. Would you be willing to meet our leader? Magic is going to be the key to winning this war. Magic? That Esper reacted to your magical powers? There's got to be a relationship. I don't know any more than you do. These powers just come naturally to me. But no human is born with the powers you have? Forgive me. Back to the, the noir. What should I do? The Empire will come, will be coming after us. They want your powers for their own. And if they get them, the world is done for. Terra, you want to understand your own powers, don't you? Then I think you should meet with Bannon. He may be able to help you find out more about why you have them. Please. <sighs> Edgar's right. There's a cave just south of here that leads to South Figaro. Let's head in that direction. It looks crisp. It looks great. King Edgar! Where are you headed, sire? Through the cave and eastward to South Figaro. We'll then make for the Returner headquarters in the north. Return to the castle and pass the word along. Understood, sire. Take care. Anybody remember the directions? <laughs> Just go north, right? So glad there's a finally a good port for this game. I'm really excited as well. I've been waiting for this. I had PlayStation 1 version, I had the old Steam version as well, but I've been I've been waiting for the port like this. Wow, look at the Ooh, recovery spring. Look at the water in the mini map. Beautiful. I'm a big Final Fantasy fan, but never had a chance to play Final Fantasy VI uh, till now, so very excited right now to finally get a proper, like, good port and finally be able to play it. I hear the Empire has been invading one town after another. I wonder how safe we are in South Figaro. You look just like the students of Duncan's. Tyra. Duncan's been training his boy Vargas along with his other students. He's always grumbling about how the kid never seems to be making any progress. Ooh, tea. Right. Ignore us, maybe we'll just disappear. Back off, Locke. That guy looks familiar. Ooh, another party member. Let's go. He comes and goes like the wind, swearing allegiance to no one. Hidden behind his wintry gaze lies a face known to none who live. Is that a ninja? Oh, his name is just Shadow. Can we call him Bob? That's less edgy. What is this place? Oh, people trip. Let's just go in and, and see what's in the here. Hmm? What's that smell? <laughs> you can't just go into somebody's house and... <laughs> These dishes, they're just like the ones he always used. Oh, is that your your buddy, Edgar? Edgar just knows everyone. Male, female, doesn't matter. Oh yeah, let's rest up. Free HP. Could Sabian be living here? Oh, Wait, Sabian is Duncan? Wait, what? Thank you so very much for the followers. Welcome. Hey, Zekon. Thank you so much for joining. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us in the stream. Are you also a Final Fantasy fan or just interested in this uh, new game? Sabin in the cabin. <laughs> Wait, I want to talk with this old dude first. Hey! Do you happen to know where I could find a man who lives here? 
Sure do. Left a couple of days ago, soon as he heard Master Duncan had been killed. Headed up into the mountains. What do you mean Master Duncan had been killed? I thought he's gonna be a party member. <laughs> they say Duncan's son Vargas is missing too. I don't like it one bit. F for Duncan. Wow, I just... I didn't even have a chance to meet him. <laughs> oh no. Wait, there's gonna be some kind of plot twist. You'll see. It's been a while since we played like a story game on stream as well. Let alone a Final Fantasy game. This is like playing a brand new game for me, you know. It's just really... Uh... It is really, really freaking awesome right now, for myself. <laughs> a little pink tent with a bow. Sabin sent you, didn't he? Oh, it is Vargas. It is Vargas. <gasps> oh my god, he just kicked me in the face! Who are you? Sabin? Is he here? He wasn't in the cabin. <laughs> you were the one sneaking around us the whole way up here, weren't you? And if I was... Hm. Well, it doesn't matter who you are. I have no intention to surrender. <laughs> oh my gosh. Thank you so much, sir. Woe is the day you met me. It will be the last day of your lives. Oh no. Another an bad ending? That's a dollar for the square jar! Hype train. I thought he was gonna be like a party member or something. What is this? This looks scary. This looks really scary. Okay guys, boss fight, let's get it. Ooh, the magic animations are really pretty. <gasps> Kill yourself! Women! Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Edgar! What the hell? This is gonna be tough, dude! His legs are longer than your entire party! I'm so scared! <gasps> no, look! Is Edgar only protecting girls? Is that what it is? Is this another freaking Zidane situation? Oh my gosh, burn you bear! That's money. Some good luck, cheering no cheap less. Thank you, thank you so so much for the support. Six hundred bitsies? Are you kidding me? Thank you very very much, sir. <laughs> Thank you, Rock and Roller. Thank you, Anonymous. A cheer as well. Thank you, thank you. Okay, guys, we got to Vargas. Gotta keep uh, Terra. And High Spirit. Okay, we're dealing much more damage than he, so uh, I think this I think this looking good. I think this looking good for us. <gasps> Missing noise blaster. I want man, I'm having so much fun seeing the dancing emotes you guys are using. <laughs> Kill him for a divine strudel. I'll do my best, I'll do my best. I kind of want to see if I can steal something from him, though. Should I, should I try? Should I, should I try? Look, it keeps failing, though. I'm scared. Music's so good! Come on, Locke. Come on, my man. I know you have it in you. 
OG Tancred, you can do it. Potion? Enough of this. Uh oh. Oh no, I'll send you all to the great beyond. Let's, let's, let's chat, Vargas. Oh, it's a story fight. That's not Vargas. <laughs> Why? We're so small and cute. We have no chance against him. Ah, if it isn't Sabin. Who said you can leave your cabin? I'm not gonna get bored of this joke. Sabin be dabbin. Why, Vargas? Why did you kill Master Duncan? How could you murder your own father? Let me see that. Big plot, guys. Oh, Edgar is so sad. The fool snubbed me. His only son. Uh oh, what snubbed means? He chew. He chose you as his successor. <gasps> Wait, was... What? That's not true. Our master... It's true and you know it. It's written in that ugly sneer across your face. He wanted you to be his successor, not me. He knew you had the most potential. I'm sick of listening to your lies. You've got far more than just potential. Why don't you see for yourself? Or I've got... Uh oh Blizzard Fist! Um, wait, this way, huh? Ah, Sabin. My father was right to see so much in you. I guess... I guess there's no avoiding this. Fate made us train together. And now fate will send you to your doom. Oh, 1v1, Doom Fist! Now, get ready to join your beloved master. Come on, what's the matter? Oh no, there is Doom on my face! Come on, come on, Sabin! Uh, what do we say? Meteor Strike? Wait, what should I do? I've never played this game. Why hold back, Sabin? The time is almost up. Let's just attack him, I suppose. Time to put an end to this. I just need to use a blitz technique, like the master taught me. A raging fist from the blitz menu. Oh, how am I supposed to do this? Okay. Uh, left or right? Left and right, and left, and the confirm button. Alrighty. I have a save, right? I'll be, I'll be okay. Uh. He's a fighting game character. Oh my gosh, this is great. Rage and fizz! Ora, 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 ora! Ugh. You already learned that technique? Vargas, if only you hadn't been so consumed by pride! <laughs> That's a dollar for the swear jar! First try Eno let school. <laughs> try my best, try my best! Thank you very, very much for the bitsies as well, and the hype train. Appreciate you guys. Sabin! Oh, they are twins, aren't they? Edgar? My brother? Brother? You're his twin brother? If they're twins, do you really have to ask, though? <laughs> Maybe they're the twins that are looking nothing alike, but they definitely look alike here from the sprites. You're his twin brother? Uh, 
His brother? At first I thought you were another one of the Vargas bears. Any brothers in chat? You thought I was a bear? Uh, the game has new translation, yeah. Um, I guess I'll take that as a compliment. Oh, he's like... <laughs> anyway, Edgar, what are you doing here? We are on our way to the Saber Mountains. To the Returner's Hideout, no doubt. Wow, very great hideout, everybody knows about it. So, the wheels are finally turning. I've been watching from the distance, hoping the world would come to its senses. The way things were going, I was afraid Figaro would end up as a puppet state. A means of striking back has presented itself. There will be no more playing lapdog to the Empire. I'm through with that act. Let's go, Edgar. Think a bear, like me, could be of any help. Sabin, you would join us? Oh, The brotherly love. I think Duncan would rest easier knowing his training helped bring peace to the world. Well then, let's get going. Ayo! Hey, thank you so much for the follow, Mikhail. Welcome, get cozy. Thank you very much for the support. Hope you like it here. Hi, Dragon's Guardian. Welcome. <laughs> King Edgar, this way, please. There's this, the, the, the poo zone now, the big trumpet. Boop, 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 boop. Bannon, we brought her with us. So this is the girl, the one to whom the Esper responded. Esper? It seems the Empire had complete control over her. Carrier pigeons have kept me informed. <laughs> pigeons. Ah, uh, this music in particular. Ah, oh, it just yeah, I just feel the like Uematsu vibes, Final Fantasy VII vibes here as well. Loving it. I also heard that she wiped off 50 Imperial soldiers in mere minutes. With just this fire of mine? No, that's not... Terra. For heaven's sake, Bannon. The girl doesn't remember anything. Hiding from the truth won't change it. Perhaps you've heard this story before? Once, when people were still pure and innocent, there was a box they were told never to open. But someone went and opened it anyway, and so unleashed all the devils or evils we know today. <gasps> Pandora box. Pride, envy, greed, wrath, gluttony. The only thing that remained in the box was a single ray of light. Hope. Your powers is a gift, not a curse. No matter what happens, you must remember that. You are this world's last ray of hope. Or light. Our final hope. Warrior of light! Eyo. Bannon! I've grown weary with the hour. Allow me to rest for a while. It's me after stream. I talked for an hour. I'm like, re let me rest. Let me rest. <laughs> Locke, why aren't- why are you in my room? Hello? <laughs> Thank you so much for the follow! Get comfy, guys! Thank you very, very much for supporting the channel. If you guys are new here, I am primarily a Final Fantasy XIV JRPG and anime stream- like, anime game streamer. So, yes, Final Fantasy series means the world to me, and I hope you're gonna love the community. Everybody is really warm, very friendly. In here, I call them the Chocobros, and would um, I would be super happy if you could join us uh, here. We have a Discord server as well. Uh, the Empire took someone important from me. I've hated it ever since. 
If no one stands up to the Empire, more people will be left like me. That's why I joined the Returners. But there is no one important in my life. I have no family and no friends. That's not true. And if it was, I'm sure there are people who feel important to them. You feel important. You are... Im what? Who feel you are important to them. Okay. Those people could be counting on you. It's been a while since I uh, read the story of any like game, so I just need to get back into it. I don't know what to tell you, but I do know that I trust my brother completely. He's always thought of my needs before his own, ever since we were little. I think you should trust him too. But uh, don't tell him I said that, he'll turn red as a tomato. <sighs> it's not easy asking so much of you. And if we force our ideas on you, we are no different from the Empire. So, we want you to decide for yourself. I don't think I have any other choice, honestly, so I'm just gonna go and help them out. I feel like they're a little bit uh, more like mentally stable compared to uh, Kefka, so... Have you made your decision? Will you become our last rate of hope? No. No, I don't think I I, I, I don't think I will. <laughs> really? You will? Oh, we wanna see more of this game, so you better say yes. But I'm scared. The uncertainty you're feeling is only natural. Tara, I want you to have this. What is it? A charm to help keep you safe. Take it. I have a plan. Would you please gather everyone together? Ah, welcome back. No worries. It, it's Thursday after all. Meetings, meetings. Well then. We all know that the Gestalian Empire is using its magic power to wage a war. The question is, where do they get that power? Well, magic is just a technology, isn't it? I had Log Dick around for information. Plot! It seems the Empire has been gathering scholars from around the world to study espers. Narsh Esper was the reason for the Imperial assault there. Are you saying there's some kind of connection between espers and Magitek? Espers and Magitek. Only one possible link comes to mind. <gasps> you don't mean... The War of the Magi. No! That's impossible! My grandma used to tell me bedtime stories about magical machines. Hard to believe those stories were true. You were saying we were on the verge of a second war of the Magi? It's only a guess. The war took place a thousand years ago, and every historian has a different hypothesis. But one says that energy drain from Esperus was used to power machines, and that ordinary humans were also infused with the same energy. So that's what Magitek power is. I guess I, if I say Magitek, I should say Magi as well. I don't know. If we're going to fight Magitek enemies, we need Magitek weapons of our own. No, that would bring another War of the Magi. Then what do you propose? I was wondering if we might be able to have a chat with an Esper. With an Esper? It's risky, but that Esper reacted to Terra before. If we could get it to react to her again, we just might be able to wake it up. Do you really do you really think that would work? I can't say for sure, but I believe it's our best shot. Of course, we can't do anything without Terra's help. Terra. I'll do it. I'm not entirely sure I understand the plan, but what the hey? Uh oh. What was that? That noise just now? Bannon, sir! Uh oh, plot! It's thickening. <gasps> South Figaro. <gasps> no! 
we just got back from there. What's wrong? What's happened? The Empire's taking South Figaro. They're headed this way. Oh, I'm not surprised, honestly. So they found us. We haven't a moment to lose. Look, I know someone has to sneak into South Figaro to slow down the enemy, right? This is right up your alley. We are counting on you. Terra, wait for me. I won't be gone long. And watch out for a certain lecherous young king who shall remain nameless. <laughs> a guy moves in like a hog. Lock. Edgar. Old abbots. Old habits die hard, eh? Oh my gosh, like, there's invasion and... What is this humor? What about us? We can escape down the Leith River and make our way to Narsh. Okay, down to the river, on the way back to Narsh. I'm curious about that esper they found in the mines. Very well. I'll ready the raft by the back entrance. It's risky, but we don't have much of a choice at this point. Ah, it's not safe here. Come with us to Narsh. It could be a chance for you to gain a better understanding of your abilities. We've no time to dilly-dally. Let's make for Narsh. Let's go, let's go. Uh, head towards Narsh while protecting Bannon at all cost. <gasps> if Bannon falls in the battle, the journey's over. Oh. Uh, wait, do I control? No. Oh, he is in a party. Okay. Holy shit. He's in a party, so we just have to... Whatchamacallit. Protect him. Yes. Yeah, of course I can do it. This is not my first rodeo. Ooh, nice. Been playing Final Fantasy games since I was... 15. <laughs> I got it, I got it. Oh shit, Bannon is like... 11 <laughs> HP. Those monsters know who is... Who is the target? Like, those are really, 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 really smart monsters. Uh oh. Are we going. Uh, let's go left because. Who would want to go straight? Ah, Ultros. Oh, is this his first appearance? Of course, I kind of forgot he is from Final Fantasy VI. I totally freaking forgot. Hey. What have we got here? <laughs> oh no, he's a boss. <laughs> You're up the creek without a paddle. I'm not gonna let you through. Does that make me a bad octopus? <laughs> Very bad octopus. We're gonna put you in fire. Uh, Yowch! <laughs> Seafood soup is not on the menu. Oh no, the blindness. Thank you, thank you, rock and roller. <laughs> I'd love to get my tentacles around her. No, don't say that. No, truth. No bad octopus. Very bad octopus. Oh no, Terra died. What the heck? Okay, focus mode. Bad octopus. Super bad octopus. Ew, no. Muscle heads? Hate them. 
Oh, I think Sabin is gonna be targeted next. What is this damage? Okay, so he says who's he's gonna like target next. Nah, the tentacle! Ew! No. Yeah, the magic looks really, really pretty. <laughs> hey, that noob. Thank you so much. Did the noisy on the critically acclaimed MMORPG Final Figure 14 has to free trial and in wheels the entirety of a realm rebound and the award winning Heavensward expansion up to level 60 with no restrictions on playtime? Signeth up and enjoy the. Hey, who is here the present day? I'm gonna keep them as safe as possible. Even if this is a little bit of a waste, I'm much better than just keep them safe. Oh! He gone! Splush! Blub blub. The bongo cats. Think it got the point? I wouldn't bet on it. It's probably just hiding down there. Ew! Something is stuck to my leg. Terra, get away from there. We should be all right now. Should. Eight armed freak. I'm gonna smash it with a blitz. No, Sabin. Out of my way, Edgar. <sighs> well, goodbye. Well, he's always been a bit rush. Sabin. Oh, he'll be fine. Are you sure, Bannon? You are his brother. You should know better than any of us. Any second now, he will flop back up onto the raft. Right as rain. What? I think he missed the onto the raft part. Ha! Huh. Sabin! Sabin, you're on your own now. Uh, he, jo <laughs> he just joined my party! <gasps> Sabin! Suplexing the water. <laughs> oh, Sabin. <laughs> Bye! No, Sabin, wait! I liked him in a party. Edgar and Terra raced towards Narsh while protecting Bannon. But what of Sabin, who was swept away by the raging waters? And how is Log faring after having penetrated the Empire's defenses in South Figaro? Is it all going according to plan? Choose a scenario? What is this? I've never seen anything like this in a Final Fantasy game. Oh no! Oh man, which one you guys want to see first? Oh, this is so great! Awesome. So which one Ina will pick? Make sure to tune in for part two. 